Hello, I'm Joe Renz. Senator Jim Merritt of Indianapolis says he's going to push for legislation next session that would dramatically increase penalty enhancements for criminals that use a gun. Over the weekend, two police officers, one in Indianapolis and one in Gary, were shot and killed. Seven bystanders were also injured in a shootout in an Indianapolis neighborhood. Merritt says the time is ripe to send a message to criminals who use guns. Last session, Merritt co-authored a bill that allows prosecutors and judges to add anywhere from five to 20 years to a sentence if a gun was used in a kidnapping to illegally restrain someone or if the crime resulted in death or serious injury. Merritt says next session he'll promote a bill that creates a mandatory enhancement. That is, if you have a gun and brandishing it, you don't even need to fire it. You'll be eligible for a 20-year enhancement if you're convicted of the crime. And the Bureau of Motor Vehicles will ask the Indiana Supreme Court to overturn a lower court order to restart the state's personalized license plate program. BMV Commissioner Don Snemis says a notice of appeal will ask the justices to overturn the ruling of Marion County Superior Court Judge James Osborne in May. The ruling said the BMV violated the First Amendment rights of some of those whose personalized plates had been denied. Snemis' main objection is with Judge Osborne's rewriting of the guidelines used by the BMV to determine which personalized plates are proper. A quick check of the weather forecast, a 60% chance of thunderstorms continued tonight, lows down to 70 degrees, and that approaching frontal system will continue to bring multiple chances for thunderstorms and severe weather through Tuesday. Here's the five-day forecast. Uh, temperatures much warmer, 82 degrees Tuesday and Wednesday, clearing out Wednesday and Thursday with highs in the lower 80s. More news online at WTIUnews.org.